Pastor Robert Turner here of New Birth Ministries. Today is Friday. We're going to close our week out strong. Let's hear what the voice of the Spirit will have to say to the church. So let's get into it. Let's go. So let's go to Ephesians, the sixth chapter. I want to read verses 13. And I want to read out a King James Version. And it says, Therefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, that you may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all to stand. Now listen, whenever you're putting on the whole armor of God, that does not mean that you will avoid the evil day. But what it's telling you is that when the evil day comes, you will be able to stand. And then when the evil day continues, you will continue to stand. The reason why a lot of us in our culture today do not have the fortitude to keep standing is because our generation now draws value from visibility. We draw our value from being seen. So therefore we became addicted to the stage, but we are allergic to the altar. We are addicted to the stage, but we are allergic to the altar. And it's at the altar where I learn to put on the whole armor of God. It's at the altar where I get my strength to be able to stand. The Bible tell us when the evil day comes, well, he gave me enough fortitude to stand during the evil day. It's called an evil day, not an evil life. And you don't have to do anything wrong for an evil day to come. You understand? You don't have to do a bunch of sinning for the evil day to come. It will come, but it's telling you that if you are not allergic to that altar and you submitted yourself to burning and sacrificing something on that altar, you will be able to sustain the whole armor of God and keep on standing when the evil day approaches itself. So I wanna just tell you, despite what it looks right now, it's just the day, it's not your life. Keep standing.